All right, so today we are working on the balcony. It has been almost a year since I've touched the balcony, actually since the last video of me like deep cleaning it. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing today just so we can enjoy sitting outside since we're social distancing. And yeah, let's show you the mess because it's really, really filthy. Alright, so first things first is getting everything out of the way so we can fully deep clean the balcony so we'll be moving everything inside and some of the things that need to be cleaned or dusted off Eric will be doing that in the shower or sink as you can tell I have a bunch of bags filled with clothes I recently decluttered my closet and I haven't gotten the chance to take it to donate next step is the outdoor rug as you can imagine it is very very dirty so we just decided to dust it off as much as we could and then roll it in to the apartment in the meantime By the way, as we are bringing things in and moving everything out of the way, I am also making sure to declutter whatever we don't need and getting rid of things that I no longer want. So now bringing in the cleaning products, I have this tub filled with water, a brush, Fabuloso, Clorox, just a bunch of cleaning supplies. I made sure to move the plug or lights out of the way. Then applied some of the cleaning products on the wall and then Eric went ahead and cleaned it with the broom, a little bit of water and the product. Basically just brushing everything off. If you guys remember my cleaning video from last year for my balcony, I did this exact thing and honestly it's the best way to fully deep clean your balcony, disinfect it and just get rid of all of the dust and dirt. So I love doing this once a year, I feel like it's very important especially with how dusty and dirty New York City is and it just made such a huge difference. All right, now with some Fabuloso water and a cleaning rag, I'm just going to be doing the same on the walls and windows.
on to my favorite and least favorite parts at the same time just because I personally love splashing water I feel like it's so satisfying but since we don't have a hose outside it's really tedious to just keep bringing tubs of water so I just keep repeating the same steps splashing water all over the walls windows and floor moving it to the drainage hole which is in the corner over there in case you guys were wondering and then I'm just going to be cleaning the rest of the things with fabuloso and water and just some cleaning supplies Now continuing to do the same on the railing, just making sure not to water people downstairs because I can only imagine how awful it would be. So I just make sure no one was walking by and just kept cleaning. just because I am extremely OCD I decided to make Eric flip the chest so I can clean it in the bottom which was honestly a little bit unnecessary but it was done Alright, so last step when it comes to cleaning is just mopping the floor just all over again, basically drying it off completely. Oh, never mind. I'm going to be cleaning the windows now with this glass cleaner that I am completely obsessed with. You guys literally need this. It's the best thing to clean mirrors and windows, especially because I have these really large windows that get very dusty and dirty quite often. Alright, so last but not least is just putting everything back in place in the balcony and moving the furniture around.
And here is the finished look. I am not going to be mentioning everything I have because I literally just reused everything I mentioned in my last video from last year. So I'll be linking that down below for you guys. But I will be making a makeover video for my balcony really soon. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time. Bye! Are you excited? So excited, can't <laughs> wait. Where are we gonna start? Your wife is saying I'm looking like a whole snack.